first song. I think Our Ship Sinking was the first one. Um, uh, I don't really remember. I mean, it's, writing is kind of um, a convoluted thing, and I don't really can't really follow the. Wow, dig your blue hair. That's cool. <laughs> Sorry. So this, what, was there was there like a, a vision for the album, like as a whole, and you started filling it in, or did it just kind of, you know, spontaneously combust? It spontaneously combusted. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it's about uh, that we're screwing up the world, and uh, and someone's got to say it, you know. I mean, everyone's kind of going, well, it'll be okay, but it's not going to be okay unless we do something about it. Uh, and but the song, the album is about the song about relationships in living in this world with people with blue hair. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. What? Hi, Missy. I have a question. Can we claim that One Way Street is part of the Yellow River? <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can. Thank you. It's all yours. All right, one question, and then we're going to probably have to start. Yes. I saw your YouTube video today of you busking on the subway. Oh, yeah, I know. How wacky was that? <laughs> when was the last time that you were so close to your audience, and how excited were you to do that? That was it. <laughs> yeah, that was it. That was a close up. No, actually, in my live shows, I get right into the audience. I walk right through the audience, and uh, it's a very, it's a very full contact uh, sport coming yeah. to my shows. <laughs> yes. um, but that was pretty unique. I never, I first a, I've never been on the subway. <laughs> I know, I know. We don't even have subways in Australia. You can't dig underground because the, the earth isn't strong enough. But uh, uh, it was pretty unique. Yeah, it was great seeing all those people go to work and holding up their cameras, and it was pretty funny. It must yeah, have been amazing, though, to see like how much your songs mean to everybody so immediately, like that. Was, uh, and watching the video, it was really everyone was singing along and having such a blast doing that. It yeah, it was pretty. Uh, it was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. They were uh, going. God, this sounds like Rick Springfield. Who was that? <laughs> Definitely one of my. Fun. We actually were rehearsing our new our. Uh, for, we were rehearsing for the album, and uh, uh, there was a guy from uh, from Guns N' Roses who has a band, the, the drummer. Was uh, Matt, Matt Sorum. Right, and and he's come to some shows, and uh, and and they they came into the same rehearsal place and go, God, that Rich Springfield sounded like band. They're really good. 